Hello there, and welcome to my little UI demo. And this is what we're going to be making in my tutorial series. Really simple menu that kind of fluctuates in 3D space. If you mouse over these buttons, they kind of pop out, and they change colors and things like that. And if you click New Game, it'll load a new game. Or if you click Settings, it'll transfer to the Settings menu, and then you'll see the camera do a movement. And if you have your own level, it's already built, you can do your own custom camera animations and do some really cool stuff, like just cool things. I don't know, but that's all up to you. This is just an empty room to test all that and to show off the main menu and the fact that we can move the camera. And we can also change resolution, but I'm using Fraps to record right now, and every time I change resolution in game and hit, and like Fraps kind of causes my UDK to crash, so I'm not going to click that button. But if you're not in Fraps, I mean, it'll change resolution all you want. It's really cool. But, um, yeah, so go ahead and hit back. Click the main menu. And, uh, yeah, so now there is a one issue with all this is that sometimes when you move the camera, the camera kind of flickers. Not sure why that is, but if you know why that is, please tell me so I can fix that. That'd be really, really cool if someone were to help me know what that was. Now, that being said, we can go a uh, new game and it's going to load deck because that's what I have it coded to do right now. But you can have it do whatever you want. And right now, I'm using a blank game info class so it doesn't know how to handle this loading screen. But your level's loaded here and you can walk around and you can do stuff, whatever. So that's, that's the main that we'll be creating with my little tutorial series. So if you're interested, go ahead and watch the series. And there's two part, there's two kind of sub-series. There's one, it's 11 videos long, about an hour and a half, kind of long, but that's if you don't know any Flash at all. There's a second little video where it's just two videos, or actually three. One is how to install a little four course UI thing. We'll go over what, th what that is. And then the second one is building the Flash part, and the third one is doing the Unreal side. And you're done. Really, really simple. That's for people who already know what they're doing, both in Flash and Unreal. But if you have no idea and you're new to Flash, go ahead and watch my first series. Kind of long, but gives you an idea how to do everything. Alright, thank you for watching.